ladies and gentlemen, the nether portal. Finally! <laughs> Welcome back to yet another Minecraft video. I want to thank you for 15 subscribers because now you guys get to listen to my voiceover and that's pretty cool. But remember to subscribe to Top or that other person in the description. So thanks and enjoy the Minecraft video. Today we have two big tasks I want to accomplish. First one is going to the nether and the second one is making an enchantment table as you just saw I was doing. So yeah, um, I've already been to the nether, but um, I actually went there with that other person. I was going to put that video on YouTube, but then I realized that um, that I lost the footage, so I couldn't really do that. But yeah, anyway, so those are the things that we're going to be doing today. So I think it's important to bring to the nether ladders and torches so i'm going to be stocking up on ladders and torches oh and um food can't forget that i'll also be doing lots of fishing and maybe even making an anvil so i can get some enchantments if i don't make the anvil this video i'll make the anvil next video so yeah this is my first voiceover vids and thank uh, thank you again for helping me reach 15 subscribers okay so now we're going to enter the nether portal it looks like yeah, so, ladies and gentlemen, the nether portal. I've already been to the nether, as I said before, to work on the portal, to put cobblestone around it so it doesn't get blown up by a gas fireball. We had a pretty lucky spawn, but then I realized it actually wasn't that lucky because of the... It's so hard to find a nether fortress. It's pretty much crammed right into the middle of a tunnel. Oh my goodness, that zombie pigman scared me. I forgot about that. Make sure you do not hit the zombie pigman, because then all zombie pigmans will come after you, and that will be terrible, because then you'll be getting swarmed. Okay, so as you can see, we're kind of in the middle of a pit tunnel thing, so we had to mine our way out over here. Yeah, and basically, then we had to make a ladder up uh, out of this giant pit with ladders. Didn't I just say that? Yeah, I did. Okay. <laughs> And there's lots of soul sand on the ground, which makes it hard to walk, so you don't have to make a path for that. Yeah. I'm going to use torches to guide my way so I don't ever get lost. That would be pretty bad. I've already died a couple times in the nether. It was really frustrating the first time when I played with top. So, hope I don't die. <laughs> the bad thing about dying is that your stuff can get picked up by zombie pigments, I'm pretty sure. Which sucks because then you lose like all your good stuff. Sorry guys about the quality of the uh, video. I really hope I get a computer for my birthday because that makes things so much easier and I could actually get a decent screen recorder. It's hard to get a good screen recorder that doesn't cost any money so I have to screen record the screen record on my iPad and put that on YouTube which is kind of dumb but it's the best way. I put a lot of time and effort in my videos. So, um, I'm really hoping for all the subscribers I can get, so that one day I can become a pretty decent channel. Yeah, so right now I'm going to, uh, oh, there's a giant zombie pigman hole thingy. So I think I'm going to keep exploring the nether, see if I can hopefully find a fortress, and then farm wither skeleton and um what you call it's blazes really hope i don't run into any uh magma cubes those things are kind of annoying because they just keep multiplying whenever you kill them and they hardly ever drop magma cream plus i don't even know what magma cream is good for i know that slime balls are good for rope i think so you can like tie your horse up really hope i can find a saddle because i know where horses are nearby in the overworld, but I can't really get a saddle. I thought you could, um, craft a saddle, but then, apparently you can't. I looked it up and said, nope, cannot craft a saddle, it can only be found in, like, in, under, or, what should we call it, the, uh, sea dungeon thing, and nether fortresses. So right now I'm trying to build my way down, hopefully, 
it's really hard to do it on um, mobile because you just gotta get very edge and then if you fall it's you might fall into the lava in this case which sucks because then you burn up and die which really sucks oh darn <laughs> that's what i was sort of trying to avoid whatever i'll make it work i guess okay now i guess i'll have to build my way up hopefully join them together use a couple extra ladders darn <laughs> i guess i would have had to jump anyway because it's hard to build your way all the way down at least i didn't fall in the lava because that would really suck okay so once i finally make the ladder way down then i think i'm gonna either go right or left or build my way across the lava <laughs> either way it sounds too promising yeah, like I said earlier, a really unlucky spot, I guess. I really need to build this bridge higher before I fall right into the lava. Yeah, that would really suck more than anything I said sucks so far. Three, two, one. Jump! Oof, duh. <laughs> to build that ladder, then I can find a way to go, and then hopefully we can find another fortress by the end of the episode. Um, I hope I find the right direction to go, because, as you can see, we're just kind of in a giant hole. I might have to, like, build a bridge across the lava. I think that's what I'm going to do at some point. Snap up some of this magma block. I think that's what it's called. Ooh, can't walk on the top of that, apparently. Okay, now let's pick up some of this cobblestone, and hopefully find a way to, um, trick across that lava. Oh, well, maybe I'm gonna go over here first, I guess. I don't remember going over here. But yeah, I do, because then there's just a dead end, and then I have to turn around. Wow. Yeah, this is really unlucky. I wish I had another spawn. Better another spawn. Yep, dead end. I wonder if you could make, like, two nether portals. Because then that would be a lot easier, because I could just get another spawn point. And then, hopefully end up in a greater spot so now i'm gonna build the cobblestone bridge uh, my way across hopefully make it across without dying <laughs> it's always a big problem i guess in minecraft don't die <laughs> okay so now i'm making my way over to um the other side oh my that was a lot of lava Oofta. yeah so let's see how this works Hopefully I can get across. Oh, there it all goes. Okay, this will be really easy now. Walk across, no more lava problems. And we're at a dead end again. That sucks. Okay, that's pretty terrible. Okay, so now I'm just gonna mine my way out and hope for the best. Hopefully I can get over. Yeah, but it looks like a dead end. Wow. I don't know, that's really disappointing. Um, wow. Okay, so, on that note, I'd like to thank you, and please subscribe to Top, link in the description. Yeah, that was a pretty bad video. You guys might hear background noises, noises, because that's, right now I'm recording in the lunchroom of my school, so, yeah, I really need, like, a better spot. <laughs> I could do it in my house, but I really want to try to upload daily. So, yeah. Just remember to subscribe to Top and me if you haven't already, and drop the video a like. So thanks for tuning in and joining me for the seventh Minecraft episode. Anyway, so next episode I'll be making an anvil probably, maybe even finding lapis so I can enchant things. Yeah, so that's pretty cool. I really want an enchanted bow. Maybe I can get that. Yeah. So, like I said, thanks for joining me on my first voiceover. Which I actually did a pretty good job on my voiceover. So thanks. Um, my friends are shouting at me, so I better go. And they're dancing, and it's really weird. Bye. I will leave you guys in awkward silence.